Gus, it's the Cup on Wednesday, but now just a chance to focus on the league, bounce back, and then even a chance of regressing in the Cup next week. No, obvious disappointment from Tuesday night, eh, sorry, Wednesday night. Um, Considering how well we played on the Saturday up at Inverness in a tough game, we, we let ourselves down. There's, there's no question of that. We we didn't compete in the manner which we would have liked. But you've got to move on. You know it's it's disappointing. But now we're at home against the uh, United with the opportunity to go above them if we win the game. So that's the incentive for everybody, all the players. Um, we all appreciate how important that game it is. Air United will have exactly the same mindset as well. But we're at home, so we've got to make that advantage count. You mentioned it as a home game, we've said a few times, you know, we've got our own home games coming up, so it must be important to make them count. Yeah, I think that's, we've maybe looked at it and thought we'll, we've had a hard sort of start to it because of the early fixtures that, you know, even though we're 15, we've had eight away and seven at home, we've not picked the points up at home that we should be, um, but now we've got three home games, you know, the two in the league and one in the cup, we've got the opportunity to rectify that and hopefully we can do that, you know, and start having the, the belief within the group that she's they show at certain times but then other times you know they just lack a little bit of confidence but there's no better way you know to climb the table get three points you know and get that belief back in the squad the past couple of games we've seen Alexander King make a few sub appearances and he's not looked out of place at all how important is it having youth like him that can come on in times when they're well, I think that was part of the remit when we came in was that the youth got a chance we've shown that we're prepared to do that, you know, and Alexander's just the latest one. Um, you've had McGratton, you've had Lyons, you've got Hines, they've all had involvement within the squad. We've, we've loaded that in terms of not having too many senior players so that the younger players will always get their opportunity. But they've got to earn it. It doesn't, you know, guarantee that you're going to start a game or be involved in a game. You've got to show the right application, the right attitude, um, because it is a albeit not in terms of numbers, but it's a competitive squad that we've got and that's what you're looking for. So the young players have got to earn their opportunity. Just looking at the area now, just your thoughts going into it? Oh, we're at home. You know, I think um, Air won their cup tie uh, against Albion Rovers and from the report that we got, you know, it was comfortable. Scoreline doesn't suggest that, but comfortable. They missed a penalty as well. So they know, you know what type of game to expect. We can't disappoint them. It's got to make sure that we're on the front foot, positive at every opportunity, get supply to our strikers, get crosses into the box uh, and make sure that we're, we're working the Air United defence. So we've got to try and play at a, a higher tempo, you know, not try, we will play at a higher tempo than what we did on Tuesday night, uh, so keep saying Tuesday, Wednesday night and make sure that we're on the front foot. When you look at the last Air game and you take into consideration the next month, can we expect to see changes in players getting chances? I think we've shown that already, that players will get chances. Um, we've got to make sure that our energy levels are high, you know, in, in every single game. So, with the squad as it is, we've got Alan missing, we've got Brian McLean missing, so we're short in the defensive area as well. So, um, Jimmy Olds has went back as well. So, we've, we're short in numbers, but we've got to make sure that we, we get the selection right that gives us the opportunity to play on the front foot and be as positive as we possibly can. You mentioned those three players there, is there anyone else that's going to be missing? Uh, no, 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 that's the only three that will be missing. Um, obviously, Brian um, is still injured, Jimmy's obviously longer term and uh, Alan's suspended. So, no, it's just, we're challenged at the moment, no question of that, but it then becomes the opportunity for players that have maybe been a little bit frustrated that they've not had game time. So they'll get that in the next coming of weeks and they've got to make the most of it.